Hey guys, Housewife Until Heaven. I've got a couple videos that I hope to get up tonight um, that I think are extremely time sensitive and important. Um, but the first video that I want to do for you guys is something that is just amazing. I think it's, it's so awesome. It encouraged my heart so much when it happened and I hope that it will do the same for you when I tell you about it. Um, so let me give you a bit of backstory of, of why this is important to me. Um, several years ago, back in 2014, I was dying from a brain tumor and, you know, just struggling constantly in and out of the hospital, super sick. Um, I had seizures, terrible nausea and vomiting, um, you know, insomnia, couldn't sleep just visual disturbances, just so many things going wrong from that brain tumor. And really struggling, you know, this, this particular day. Um, but I thought, okay, I'm gonna go over to my mom and dad's house. I'm gonna hang out there for a little while. And so um, I don't live too far from my parents. It's like a five minute drive. And so I leave my housing development and I'm, um, driving down the side of a road and I look over to the right and they're sitting in um, some sort of a soybean, I guess a soybean field, was a bald eagle. And at, at first I was like, I am not seeing this because where we live, I mean, there are no bald eagles. There's no eagles um, that I know of where, where we live. And I definitely had never seen one before. And so I just was kind of like, no, I didn't see that. So I kept driving and then I was like, I, I have got to turn around. I have got to park my car on the side of the road and I need to go see if I can get some video footage of this eagle. And so that's what I did. I turned around, parked on the side of the road and um, got out of my car and got my um, camera out. Didn't have a camera phone at the time, so it was just a normal camera. And I got that, that eagle on, on film. And when I first started filming it, it kind of flew up and flew away from me. And then the next thing I know, here it comes. It, it's flying towards me and then it flies just right over me, right over my head. This gorgeous, you know, full grown, fully matured, um, you know, white head, uh, the rest of the body black and the white tail um bald eagle and so i recorded it i filmed it um until it just went out of view and that was just it was so shocking and so stunning to to see it and then to get that footage of it um so i get back in the car and i can't wait to get to my parents house to show them the video and as i'm listening to the radio it was the chris tomlin song um, I will rise and it's amazing because I had just seen this bald eagle flying over me and then the lyrics to this song say I will rise on eagles wings you know no more sorrow no more pain no more suffering I will rise and that just that let me know in that moment that I was going to be okay. I was going to survive the brain tumor. I would survive the surgery and I would live and I would rise up. And so that was just amazing. And I'm going to put up the video of the footage that I got of that eagle for you guys also. So after that, you know, eagles were very significant to me. And so my mom got me this, this is my eagle and it sits on my dresser. Um, and it's just such an awesome reminder to me um, that when I was struggling that day and, and in my life and so sick and, and so close to death, knowing that I would rise up on eagle's wings. And so um, that leads into what I want to tell you now. So a couple weeks ago, um, I, I was waking up and two words were in my spirit. It was Philadelphia and eagles or eagle and this was before 
the Philadelphia Eagles were going to be in the Super Bowl. This was before um, they had won that game to, you know, send them to the Super Bowl. And so, you know, I didn't even know that they were in the running. I didn't know. And so those two words were my spirit. And so I, I prayed about it. Well, you know, Lord, what does that mean? And the Holy Spirit said to me, the Philadelphian bride, the Philadelphian church are about to rise up on the wings of the great eagle and are going to be taken out of here. And so that's what was put in my spirit. Philadelphian bride are about to be given the wings of the great eagle and are going out of here. And then I find out that the Philadelphian Eagles are going to be in the Super Bowl. So I don't know what is going to happen tomorrow um, with the, the how that game is going to play out. Um, but I would not be surprised if the Philadelphian Eagles are victorious um, as a type of, of what is about to happen for the Philadelphian church, the true bride of Christ. We are going to be victorious and we are going to be taken out of here. The wings of the great eagle. Um, so yeah, I hope that that encourages you guys. There was a lot of things that happened this week. There are some things that I'm actually very concerned about um, that pertain to this game tomorrow and different things that have happened this week that are kind of all leading up to, I think, leading up to a head, um, you know, and could be very explosive. So I will talk about that in another video, but I wanted to tell you guys about my eagle story and why it's significant to me. The fact that I'd seen that eagle and then I get back in the car and it's the words, rise up on eagle's wings. That was the personal message to my heart from the Lord, from the Holy Spirit. And um, then when he told me two weeks ago, Philadelphia, eagles, that's that's what's about to happen so be encouraged and um yeah you know uh like subscribe share um as as we're growing the channel um together and i i pray that it continues to bless each of your hearts and um i will talk to you guys next time <laughs>